Hello YouTube friends. This is Shay. Shay and Pine. I am here with a new project for us to do and I hope that every one of y'all will participate. I think it will be really fun. We just got home from church, by the way, uh, Wednesday night. And I wanted to do this earlier, uh, but didn't find a chance to get around to do it. So I'm late tonight after church, even making my video, and then as soon as I get it made, I'm going to make it. But does everybody see this? Let me make sure I've got it right. Yes, got it right. So, I'll get it like this, and then I'll get it like this. This is a book. These are envelopes, by the way. So this is an envelope book. Um, what I would like for us to do is, see, I've put this together. It's 12 envelopes, and they're the long, narrow ones. And I put three holes in them, and I put three rings in them to make it a book. Okay. I want, we also need to figure out what to call this. It's going to be a type of a swap. It's not a challenge, so there won't be like one winner. It'll be a swap, so everyone will get something. Um, so what? Envelope book. I don't want to just say envelope book swap because that'll make you think that we're all making these and swapping them and that's not what it is. Um, so I don't know. Y'all help me come up with a good uh, thing to call it. Envelope book, envelope book challenge swap or swap challenge or something. I don't know. I don't know what to call it. So y'all help me come up with a good idea name to call it. Okay. Uh, Y'all sign up to do this with me under the, in the comments, under this video. I'm going to give everybody a week to make sure everybody signs up that wants to. You know, just leave me a text, let me, uh, not a text, I'm sorry, uh, a comment saying that you want to do this with me. Uh, or however you want to say it. I'm not like giving you a certain thing to say. So just however y'all want to say it, just let me know you want to participate with me in this. And I'm going to give y'all a week. Give everybody a week. So, next Sunday night, I will look at all the comments. And I'm going to make a list. I'm going to write everybody down that said I wanted to do it. And I'm going to write you down in order of the way you commented. Like, the first person that comments and says they want to do this with me will be the first person at the top of my list. And so on. So, <clears throat> once I ha know how many is going to participate, then I can go by that and figure out how many envelopes. It's going to just stay 12 envelopes, but how many envelopes we all get to alter and decorate. If 12 people joins, Everybody will get to decorate one envelope, front and back. Um, if, uh, I'm trying to see how this would go. If less than 12 joins, then, you know, it might be two envelopes a person. You know, it depends on however many people join. Um, if more than 12 joins, then it will be one side of an envelope, a person, you know, or however. I'm just going to do my best to try to divide it up between us all the best I can. So, that's why I need to know how many is going to join. I got a bump on my arm that itches, so it must have bit me. Anyway, so I can make my list and figure that out. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to have crafting supplies in these envelopes. Matter of fact, you can see that right there. I actually marked on it with a marker under here. 
And then I decided to use some sticky note paper to cover that up because I didn't like the way it looked. It looked ugly. And when we decorate these, we'll, we'll be decorating over the flap. So that'll be hid. We'll also, what I'm going to do is write on this what is in that envelope. But when y'all get it to decorate, it's just a sticky note. You pull it off. Then you can decorate that flap. And then if you have another sticky note or however, whatever type of pretty piece of paper you want to put there to write the items again that's in there on, do so. But it will be something like this. This envelope will be scrapbook paper. This envelope will be stickers. This envelope will be, what do I have wrote on here? Um, flowers. This envelope will be bling. This envelope will be wood, you know, veneer wood pieces. This envelope will be metal, uh, metal things. This envelope, uh oh, it's over here because I did it, it backwards once we get to the middle. This envelope will be buttons. This envelope will be bottle caps and cameos. This envelope will be beads. This envelope will be, um, right, Sherry, what does it say? Huh? I don't know what it says. I can't tell what it says. Anyway, something else. <laughs> this envelope will be ribbons. And then the last envelope, it says, make a mystery item. So that, what that means is you will make something. Small, small enough and flat enough that it will go in this envelope and it won't be that bulky. Which are a card, a tag, an ATC, um, a bookmark, um, even things like stick pins. You can do a few stick pins and stick them in there, you know. <coughs> um, you, you come up with something small enough that will fit in here. So, you even know what I mean by, I know I said bulky, but I mean real bulky. Because I know that stick pins will be a little bit bulky. So, that sort of thing that will fit in here. Uh, and it's a mystery. You know, you don't know what you're making. Okay. So, I will stick, I'm going to stick three things of each thing. Like, three different scrapbooking pages. Three different sticker packs, three different flower packs, that sort of thing. Okay, so what I will do then, once I know how many envelopes, I will decorate the amount of envelopes that we get to decorate of my part. Uh, and then I'm going to send it to the first person on the list. When that person gets it, you look through all the items that are in the envelopes and you get to choose what you would like to keep. You can keep every one of them if you want to. But you have to replace the same amount of items that you keep. If you keep one scrapbook paper, you put one scrapbook paper back in there of a different time. Um, if you keep two stickers packs out, you put two more back in. If you keep um, all three flower packs, you put three more flower packs. And it could be, I mean, you may decide you like it all and you want to take every bit of it out. All of it out of the envelopes. Just replace three back of each item, okay, and put them in their rightful envelopes. Then you decorate and you get to choose what envelope you want to decorate. You skip around. You don't have to stay in order. So you decorate your amount of envelopes that you get to decorate. And I will have the list of names in the package with the book, the envelope book, and you will send it on to the next person. So it's kind of like, sort of like a round robin deal, you know, with letters and such, but it's this way. So then that third person will get it and do the same thing. Keep out what they want, replace it back, decorate, send it on to the next person. It will go 
that will reach people like that, the last person, once they get their stuff or put it back, decorate the last pages and send it back to me. And what's left in there is my goodies then. And then the book ends up being mine too. Um, another thing that I was going to say, I'm doing this video, this is the introduction video of it. Um, it's not decorated, it's a plain thing. When I decorate my pages, I will make a video to show it. But I'm not going to put it up, I don't think, because I think I want it to be a surprise. I'm going to wait until after the whole ordeal is over with. Okay? When I send it to the first person on the list, you make a video showing now you'll have to make what I want you to do you'll be making two different videos because I want you to make a video showing the pages that you decorated but that video you don't put up until after ever after it's come back to me and I'll let you know but you will put it up under this one that way everybody can get to look at see who, what page, who decorated what pages and everything and once I get it back I'll do another video showing the whole book okay and put it under here all right um but i want you to make another video showing the items that you kept out of it now that video as soon as you do it you can put it up under here that way while this is traveling to the next person everybody can watch the video of what items you kept and did not keep or whatever and just just show what you kept. You don't have to show all of them unless you're keeping all of them. You don't have to show what you are putting back in there. Just show what you decided to keep out of it. Okay? And I hope y'all are understanding. I hope I am explaining it right. And if not, ask me or PM me and ask me if you want to. And I will do my best to try to explain it to you some more. But I think I've covered everything. I told y'all exactly how I want, it, want us to do it. So it'll go around to everybody. Everybody will get some crafting goodies and get to decorate a page. The last person will send it back to me and I will have my goodies and the book decorated by all of y'all that joined me in this. It's going to be so fun. I'm excited. I can't wait. I hope I get a lot of people to help me do this. So let's do it and let's have fun, okay? All right. Like I said, just leave a comment. Let me know if you're going to join, this, join me with this. And also, if you don't understand anything, ask me questions in the comments. Or you can PM if you want to. If you don't feel comfortable asking a question for everybody to read or whatever, PM me. And I'm going to do my best to uh, explain it better to y'all. Okay? All right. So... I'm excited. I can't wait now to see who's going to sign up and who's going to be the first one to sign up that will get it first. So, okay. Thank y'all for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Toodaloo till next time.